Welcome back, friends. We've been talking about pears and opposites and lots of different things um, and experimenting with some fruit. Um, if you've followed some of the other uh, video lessons that are in Flipgrid and such, uh, we were floating and sinking with oranges and there's an apple experiment decomposing in my window as we speak. So apples and oranges going bananas with pears was written by Sarah Pinto, like the bean. She dedicates it to my kindergarten teacher, Mrs. Arlington, wherever she may be. Now, how, and how are an apple and an orange alike? Do you have a prediction? Maybe two? Well, they both don't wear glasses. How are a bicycle and a motorcycle alike? Now, when we look at those, we know they're different colors, but I see both vehicle has two wheels and both vehicles have handlebars. Well, the author gets a little humorous. She says they both don't work in a bank. Okay, so we know this is a silly story. Are you ready for the next one? How are a cupcake and an ice cream cone alike? They both don't scuba dive. How are a bird and a kite alive alike? Well, I know they're both in the air, right? Well, they both don't talk on the phone. So silly. How are a mug and a teacup alike? You might be thinking about the handles or that they hold something warm. But Sarah says they both don't ride in the rodeo. How are a starfish and an octopus alike? A sea star and an octopus both live in the ocean where it's salty. But they both don't knit. How are an ice skate and a sled alike? Well, they both don't play jazz. If you're not sure what jazz is, we'll talk more about that a little bit later because it's a style of music that's different than uh, what we may be playing in the classroom or at your houses. But I have played it as you come into the classroom. Um, it's usually with the saxophone, as you can see. Do we have a guy with the saxophone? We don't. There's a cello, there's drums, there's a singer. Um, we'll talk more about jazz in a bit. How are a rabbit and an armadillo alike? Mm. Well, they both don't work at the dentist's office. How are a spoon and a fork alike? I was washing lots of forks and spoons today, but they both don't dance in the ballet. <laughs> now, how are an accordion and a drum alike? Can you see the accordion? We used to have an accordion in the classroom, and I've had a drum or two at my house before. Well, they both don't babysit. How are trousers? Trousers are another name for pants or jeans. How are trousers and underpants alike? Hmm. I'm wondering where she's going with this. <laughs> they both don't make good hats. And how are a book and a letter alike? They both don't go out for sushi. How are an eggplant and an artichoke alike? Mm. Mm. <laughs> they both don't go to the carnival. How are you and I alike? This is our last question. We're going to talk more about that because one of our lessons last week was comparing members of our family. We talked about some of our traits. Well, the author lends us to talk. It says we both don't. So if you're checking this out in Flipgrid, I would love to hear your response as a conclusion. If not, you can shoot me an email. All right, stay well.